hi guys welcome back to my channel so right now quickly quickly i'm going to get wax waxing done for the very first time and madam ritu is taking me yeah so when i get there i'll let you guys know how it goes my trash room for pain is very little but i'm gonna try my best see you guys soon guys wish me luck i'm so scared Obviously, it's going to wax for the first time, so we are just here for Opsi to wax. She has never waxed before. Well, has she? I don't know. When she comes, I will ask her. She went inside to prep because you have to prep and stuff. So, yeah, she went inside to wax, and we are going to see how it's going to go. I'm so excited to laugh at her. So, I'm taking over Opsi's um, vlog today because, well, my name is Rita. Because I convinced Opsi to wax Brazilian Hollywood cut. We had the wax in the city. It's a, well, it's a wax place in Budapest where you don't have to, basically, you don't have to book an appointment. You can just show up and you probably will have to wait longer than you would if you had booked an appointment in a different place but in this place um they also have an app where you can actually just um you can actually just wax just uh check in online so yeah we are going to wait and see how it goes because Opsi is really scared. She has never worked before, I think. This is her first time. <laughs> so I told her to come and do it. I will get to see how it is. She's inside prepping to come out and work. But I'm just outside. I'm taking over. Let me see. The place looks really nice. So, yeah. By the way, I'm wearing my hat because, oh well. I tried something dangerous with my hair and now it's a regrettable experience. But yeah, you see, when Opsi comes out, I think she's out now. I wanted to go in with Opsi just to film her face, but they won't let me go in. They said it's not okay for her to, for another person to be in the room, so she's going to do that by herself. <laughs> you see, when she comes out, her experience. Yo, I made it. <laughs> but I didn't do everything, guys. It was so freaking painful. Oh, that's cute. But that was, how did it look? Oh, you have it. You bought it already. Yeah. Yeah, it's cute. I actually got the like, gold shoes with them. Like the shoes you are saving because somebody took it to thirty seven. One leg. I took one leg of thirty eight. So, so what they put you... it for four thousand. The two legs. Yeah, yeah. So you're going to wear two different sizes. Yeah, but the, the, because I'm, I'm in between the eight and thirty seven, I do wear. So I, it's not really. What thousand? What thousand? I think a lot of money. That four thousand. Uh -huh, no. <laughs> because oh, it's oh, two other oh, legs. Uh -huh. So let's talk about how you went to go and walk only half of your bumper. This <laughs> 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 girl walked only outside. <laughs> I don't need to give you guys. Oh, thank God for lights, guys. My God. <laughs> Okay, you know what? I'm not even. I'm not even going to be. First of all, she lied to me. She said when you keep it for long, when you allow the hair to grow longer, it's not that painful. It's not yesterday I told you this is so your hair grew longer. <laughs> no, you told but me you about. This. No, you told me since one. that. You told me since about this place that it's not that painful. See, it's even scratching me. See, this one I did not buy flowers since. It's not. Nice. It's not like <laughs> <laughs> So guys. 
So I kept it. I was going to like do my own personal hygiene stuff, right? And this is my own normal bit. <laughs> I do know one for me. Um, the first time that I, I waxed was in Devil's I think everybody goes there. The one I've, I've never I've before. never done this before because I, I, I usually used to wax my brows. I told her that she's no way to come back. That's exactly what I told this one. I said, please wait. Because she told me that uh, it's going to be. I said, no, no, no. This is what I want. I said, no, no, no. I'm going to wax my brows. She told me that uh, it's going to be. This is TMI, but. She told me that it's going to be. Guys are watching. That's your business. It's going to be painful. So I just said, okay, you know what? Just remove the, from the thighs and then the top. Eh? Just, you know. <laughs> I know all of you are imagining my vagina now, but it's okay. But anybody that's ever wants to work, so even knows what it is to want their leg, imagine what's in your, 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 your you tell me your music box. <laughs> what the hell did I say that? Dumala is to call it DJ. Dumala, you better watch this vlog. What time are we taking? We which which mula are we in? We are going to see that mula. Blaha. Blaha. The mula one. <coughs> I want to fix this. Hair. This hair that I did today, I'm telling you. like. God. So. Yeah, so I told her that please, yeah, I cannot, because my tolerance for pain is very little, guys, I cannot, I can't even pierce my ear, that's how bad, I cannot tolerate pain, so, look at the person I was now following, <laughs> you are not at the same level, no, I don't like pain, the last of my life, I was like, I was asking myself, I'm like, wait, it's not that we just like pain. <laughs> Jesus. Why do we push ourselves? But it's actually addictive because you know she was about to stop, like maybe say three waxes yeah. before. No, after she did decide, she was about to stop. Then yeah, she said, okay, if I enter the trauma, I'll continue. She was about to stop and then I was like, oh, continue, just take out everything. And then I'm like, ah, this thing is actually addictive. Well, can I just say, finish everything at once? So, now we are walking to Ritsu's house. How much is this one? This one is like £25, so it will be like this. But it will rust. No, it's gold, pure gold. That's why it's expensive. But it's £25. Pounds. £95. Oh. Ah. I thought it said it's £25. There's nothing on their website that is less than £40. Pounds. And I think the one that is £40 pounds is probably eerie. Oh. <coughs> Rita is like me, when she sees something like this, can generally just juice you. Huh? Is this a. Uh, no, that's not my customer. I have customer. Jesus' house is like, there are so many markets. <laughs> <laughs> it's the market area. It's like, <laughs> my house is nice, so don't worry, I'll show you more. But, you can see African store. Two of the African stores <laughs> are going to put up and she's actually in 10 minutes from my house. Like, oh, look at this pomegranate. God, it's so huge. Yeah, it's so But this thing is so stressful to... I'll give you a photo of it. It's so stressful to eat. Well, it's to... worth it. I thought I wanted so bad. I thought it was one. Did they do it on purpose? They cut it, they cut it for you. Yeah, it's like a strawberry. It's not red enough. It's not red enough. Nice strawberry. It's nice chop. Is that old time? One kilo. Okay. This is your customer. Hmm. For one, for one. It's an old size. You get a half kilo, like 600 grams. Okay. So that's the little area. You just put in there to make it kilo. And like there. This is a hit to serve. Yum, yum. Chop. 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 Chop.
for that one. Yes. <laughs> so you can buy one. One. <laughs> one apple. Yeah. One box. No one box. Like this one. Yeah. How much is this one? One thousand seven hundred and twenty-nine. Ah. That's what you finish in one sixteen. Yes, ma'am. That's what I'm talking about. It's expensive. <laughs> Ez a folyton máshol 3500 forint egy kiló. Nálam 2990 kiló. Hogy? Szerintem holnap. Igen. Én megyek. Anna. Anna, szépen hozok. Szerintem. Ez nem kell? Nem kell. Holnap. Köszi. I mean, it's fun if you can actually letter. speak it, yeah. Like, yeah. I feel like it's. Now I can make sentences. I will make mistakes, but I can make sentences and have a conversation. I will make so you can learn German then? Yeah, I will actually try to learn German. But now that I'm here, I'm thinking it's going to be easier to learn German. I'm still in the culture, I'm still with the people, and also I'm with the kids. Like, so so they speak Hungarian? So they speak Hungarian to me, and then I speak English back to them, and they can make a decision, they speak the English. <laughs> because they know that it's either I get her to do what I want, I speak by speaking English, or I don't get what I want from her. So let me just try this thing to one that I've been begging you. To speak English to me for the past two years. The past two years. This guy did not, this boy did not speak English. But finally, now everybody is speaking English to me. He has said that other kids. It's your house. He said, Ritu, he said, IP. He said, Ritu. I said, yes, I said, IP, okay? <laughs> I think this guy's seen. That's all I'm going to say to you. <laughs> and he's so I can imagine him saying that. I can imagine him his voice. Because he has so much to say to me. He wants to just with me. He wants to tell me a lot about his weekend, about his trip with his family to America, but he can't say it in full English, you know? So he just comes and sits in front of me and talks for like 10 minutes in Hungarian. Okay, I'm picking certain things, right? And so some things I cannot pick I'll be like, really? And I'm always lucky to say that, really? At the time where it's needed. I'll just tell him, come on, yeah. He'll be like, what is he saying along? I'll be like, come on, yeah, I'll be like, yeah, and then you continue talking. I'm always lucky to say it at the right time. Go, you want to share with kids, man, me? And kids? So do you guys actually teach them, like, proper? Yeah, we teach them. Like, proper, we have classes in the day for the smaller ones, like, two, five minutes. Because, you know, uh, like, yeah, attention span. Yeah, the attention span is very small, but the bigger ones, we are trying to so what do you teach them? Math, English, or? Yeah, I'm not patient with kids at all. And then we talk. I talk to them in English. Like I can play, oh, but me to have <laughs> short attention. <laughs> like, after a while, I just want to be quiet and left alone. Exactly. So but that's, that's not going to happen. Exactly, and and and, and then when you keep disturbing me. I get irritated. And you know sometimes you get so irritated by like how they are making noise. Like, I don't yeah, or even one person is crying. Yeah, like you want to go to like, like or say, sometimes they're just playing, but they're shouting on yeah. the top of their voice. No, I can't. And you just hear either me or one of Jesus from the other end, shut up! <laughs> because it's like you want to go crazy. Oh my god, it's stressful. Like, it's it's this is like um Ali more ear. Well, yeah, yeah, oh yeah, it's true, from the back. Yeah, from the back. I press zero. Malta Guinness. Malta Guinness. What are you guys doing for Valentine? What do you guys do for Valentine's dress? See, I'm looking for Valentine ish. Just take out the cup. I think I will. Just take out the cup. I look like a real Logomba. <laughs> You look like a Cameroonian. All this, South but do you know that this thing can be fixed? Yes, just go and wash it and do your makeup. Trust me, it can be fixed. See Mitsu's house. You know, I'm going to do a house store. Let me help and do pre house store. This is where you enter from. My socks is already out of my leg. 
I'll be back. I'm not going to show you her bedroom because that's private. But I'm going to show you her filming room. This is where the magic happens. See her coats, plenty, plenty. See the mirror that she's always taking pictures. Then we have this. Rito, I can smell soup or something. What did you cook? And fish Everything too. I did today was a fail. And fish sauce, right? Mm. Yeah. Yeah. My lady was trying to dye her hair, but <laughs> watch out for that video, guys. Watch out. Then just post it like that, my dear. You just don't know which one will blow. Then. This is her nice bathroom. Very beautiful, I must say. Very nice. Let me, let me go and show you guys the. I said I will show you guys her bedroom just to respect her privacy. But let me show you her parlor, her sitting room, her TV. Have another mirror here. Then we have this. It's not actually a mess. And then we have a beautiful kitchen right here. And a beautiful garden. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Her dining. And then we have the balcony here. We still is living in a loft. Let's just put it that way. <laughs> and you guys can see because it's dark. Or... That was very pretty. Okay. Can I turn on the lights? Because I don't know why. And you're drinking hot Martina. Guys, summary of my day. The cold outside actually chilled out the morning. What did you buy from Nocino? Uh, it's the headline. Oh. Guys, it's important. That's the blade. Let me just put this down. Hair dye. Hair dye. Hair dye. I don't have a makeup, I only buy like um perfumes. <laughs> Cause it's cheaper there. I go to the store. But sometimes it's cheaper there. Not all the time. Yeah. So I did the waxing. I paid four thousand three four thousand what three hundred or so. I paid like four K sure. Four K something. That but that's because I did not wax everything. But normal waxing of everything is about, I think she said six, almost 7,000, like 6,000 something, so front and back. So if you're interested, they are nice. The woman was really, really nice. They made me feel very comfortable, it, like it wasn't enough. It wasn't enough to take the pain away. <laughs> but the woman was really nice. What else? Like the receptionist, the person there was very friendly, trying to calm me down and everything and then even the person that did the actual wax was also very especially the big stock up oh this i want this trouser i want what size does it run to uh, x x x oh x x l that is it it can fit in your yeah and they have it in that this they is small so i think that this particular okay i cannot measure it this size no i have to wear excess is it stretch is it a bit stretchy? A bit. So That's I can either wear, you know, I'll just wear excess air, I think. Just to be safe. Oh, this is really cute, though. Ah, I'm going to buy it. I have something similar to it, but that was really high waisted. Mm. And that was a long time ago. Wait, did you just get it when? Mm. Today? Just I have to go there. I mean, so you, you shop every day. See, after it was I'm bad. It was <laughs> worse. See? What? It is worse. Eh? Zara and Rito. Rito is worse. Actually, Every day I've come here, I've seen new stuff. Is... Guys, I said that this year I'm going to be financially um, responsible. responsible. So, so that's not happening. We don't know. If it's not happening, <laughs> then at least I know where I'm going to spend. When I move out of my house, I can come and sleep in Rito's house. So I don't have to pay rent. <laughs> I'm telling you, just convert that to your studio room to, to a room. <laughs> Like at least let me just stay here. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm really considering it. Anyways, back to my existing. If you want to, um, if you want to wax, you do everything there. It's really, it's really, really nice. The place is very nice. They have 
very hygiene conscious as well so i ah tip don't let your hair grow long because that was the mistake i made hey this girl don't let your hair grow long that's the mistake i made that's why i couldn't do everything because it was freaking painful so i think i'll go back well, after i have done like m my own cleansing i'll go back and because it wasn't all that bad it was just <laughs> i've done it by myself it wasn't all that bad but i just I'm, I'm, it might not be painful for you guys. I don't really like it though. Because it's orange. I don't know, there's just something off. Like it's okay, but it's not bad. Let me just put it that way. It doesn't bring out your curves well. Ah, that's the thing. I think I'm going to turn it off. Like it's nice, but it's not something worth buying. How much is it? Thank you. That's not what thank you. Um, <laughs> but it's nice. You, did you know that you can return things in any Zara Yeah, before. I, I brought something here to even return self. I used to go back to the other Zara that I buy from this mm, can, They can even come and pick it from your house. Ah, Jesus. <laughs> so yeah, guys. Yeah, that's my whole wax, Brazilian wax experience for the first time. Do I recommend? If you don't have um, pain tolerance, please don't bother. But if you have pain tolerance, like if you're good with pain, then this will definitely not be painful for you because even me that like I'm not good with pain, it wasn't that bad. Like it wasn't that bad, but there are just some specific places and points that will be really painful. But for the other parts, it was not so bad. So if you have high tolerance, then it's really nice. It's, it's, it's called Eiffel Place or I. It's called Eiffel Place, right? Wax in the City Eiffel Palace. Yeah, it's close. It's part of the building. It's in the building of that Eiffel Palace. So the whole building is just very bougie and it's really nice. And you can, after your waxing, you can go for your nice restaurant dates, dinner date <laughs> in the Eiffel restaurant. There. Yeah. It's very beautiful. I hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog. I'm sorry, my intro also was very fast because the taxi was waiting for me. So yeah, Rito recommended this place and I'm recommending this place to you guys. So check it out and I will see you in my next video.